who can figure out who's the number one team? Okay. So there's not like, like no drum roll or anything up there. Okay. I think we all know who the number one team is, but I'm going to give you a little story. I, I hope he's here, and, and I hope he doesn't have carpal tunnel after what he went through yesterday. <laughs> People that are laughing, they put him through it. There was a luncheon yesterday for David. Three hours, maybe? Longer than that. I'm sure all of you know what who Justin Bieber is, and he has this following. Yeah, you guys know where I'm going, don't you? They're, they're, they're these believers or whatever they are. Okay, we gotta come up with a nickname with you guys. Uh, it was, it was for myself anyway. One of the nicest afternoons that I've been lucky enough to spend um, with both his fans, himself, his family, um, and it again reminds me of maybe through all bad there's a little good. And when I got to, I got the privilege yesterday of watching the 300 or so of you. Um, <laughs> get to sit with him and get to share stories and experiences. You know, you all got a couple of minutes with him, and I will share something with you that has always amazed me about David, which is, that's not a show yesterday. He, when he sits down, I just saw everybody shake their heads. When he sits down with you, there were a half a dozen of us begging him to go faster. So, if you want to throw stones, throw them at me and maybe some other folks. Um, but not him. 